Story time. Theo and Gio's big adventure. Theo and Gio were two young brothers who lived together and attended the same school. They loved each other very much and always helped each other with their homework, chores and games. They also liked to go on adventures together, exploring new places and having fun. One day they decided to go to the park after school. They packed their backpacks with some snacks, water and a map. They also brought their bikes, helmets and jackets. They told their mom where they were going and she gave them a hug and a kiss. She said, have fun my boys, but be careful and stay safe. And don't forget to be back before dark. They said, we will mum, we love you. And they rode off to the park. They arrived at the park and parked their bikes near the entrance. They looked at the map and saw that there were many things to see and do in the park. There was a playground, a pond, a bridge, a hill and a forest. They decided to start with the playground and ran towards it. They played on the swings, the slide, the seesaw and the monkey bars. They laughed and cheered and made new friends with other kids. They had a lot of fun and soon they felt hungry. They went back to their bikes and ate some snacks and drank some water. They looked at the map again and decided to go to the pond next. They rode their bikes to the pond and saw that there were many ducks and geese swimming in the water. They also saw some fish and turtles and some frogs and dragonflies. They fed some breadcrumbs to the ducks and geese and watched them quack and honk. They also tried to catch some fish and turtles, but they were too fast and slippery. They also listened to the frogs and dragonflies and tried to imitate their sounds. They had a lot of fun and soon they felt thirsty. They went back to their bikes and drank some more water. They looked at the map again and decided to go to the bridge next. They rode their bikes to the bridge and saw that it was a wooden bridge that crossed over a small stream. They also saw some flowers and butterflies and some birds and squirrels. They crossed the bridge and smelled the flowers and chased the butterflies. They also sang with the birds and fed some nuts to the squirrels. They had a lot of fun and soon they felt tired. They went back to their bikes and rested for a while. They looked at the map again and decided to go to the hill next. They rode their bikes to the hill and saw that it was a steep and grassy hill that overlooked the whole park. They also saw some clouds and rainbows and some kites and planes. They climbed the hill and lay down on the grass. They looked at the clouds and rainbows and tried to find different shapes and colors. They also watched the kites and planes and tried to guess where they were going and who was flying them. They had a lot of fun and soon they felt sleepy. They went back to their bikes and took a nap. They looked at the map again and decided to go to the forest next. They rode their bikes to the forest and saw that it was a dark and mysterious forest that had many trees and plants. They also saw some shadows and noises and some tracks and signs. They entered the forest and followed a trail. They looked at the shadows and noises and tried to figure out what they were and where they came from. They also followed the tracks and signs and tried to find out who made them and where they went. They had a lot of fun, but soon they felt scared. They went back to their bikes and decided to go home. They rode their bikes back to the entrance and saw that it was getting dark. They also saw that their mom was waiting for them. She smiled and waved and said, there you are, my boys. I'm so glad you're back. How was your adventure? They said, it was great, mom. We had a lot of fun. We saw and did many things. We played, we learned, we explored. We also loved and cared for each other. We're the best brothers ever. She said, I'm so proud of you, my boys. You're the best sons ever. I love you so much. And she gave them a hug and a kiss. They said, we love you too, mom. And they hugged and kissed her back. They got in the car and drove home. They told their mom all about their adventure and she listened and smiled. They had a wonderful day and they were very happy. The end.